Okay, so welcome to another Replica Reviews video. Now, a while back I did say that we'd be doing a field strip of the Makarov and the PPK. Uh, and being quite similar, I thought I'd combine them into one video. Uh, it makes it a little bit easier on us, and uh, it's less videos to upload, etc. So, being essentially quite similar, I think we should start off uh, doing them together. So, we'll start with the Umarex Wolfert PPK here. First thing you've got to do here, take the magazine out throw it off to one side and just cock the action back like so. I find this helps uh, with the next stage that I'll show you. And again, exactly the same with the Makarov. You take the magazine out and then just take the safety off as well. Cock it back like so. Now, the next step on both guns is very, very, very similar. You pull the trigger guard down and just push it to one side with the PPK. And then with the Makarov, you pull it down and it pushes itself to one side, which is quite a neat little feature. So the next thing we're going to do is pull the slide, if I use my other hand, pull the slide back like so, lift 45 and just escort it forward off of the gun. Now essentially, that is the PPK fully stripped. Um, there's only a few things in there that you'd want to oil. But to be completely honest, I don't see why you'd want to go in there too often. If you do take the spring off, the larger end always faces forward and the shorter end here is always resting against that, uh, that plate there. So we'll put the PPK down for a second and we'll move on to the Makarov. Now having a real 9mm spring in this, this is going to be a lot harder, so I apologise in advance if this doesn't look the cleanest in the world. But you just cock it back, lift it up like so and uh, take it off. Now as I said then, all of this is a 9mm spring so it's quite a hard one to use. Now the only things in here really that you'd want to oil are all the trigger mechanism here. Obviously with the Makarov all of the CO2 and all of the air valves are in the magazine which is completely different to the PPK here which literally just has the, uh, the BBs. So once you've stripped down these guns, you maintain them, do whatever you want to them, and then that's it. So putting them back together, it's exactly the same for both guns, so we're going to start with the PPK. Now, the thing to remember with the PPK is just to make sure the trigger guard here is down and out of the way. Put the spring just inside the front of the slide, bring it back like so, put it on like that, then just pop the trigger guard back into place, fire off the action, and then you can apply your safety, and then that's the PPK done. Now, I'm hoping this is going to go well, being the uh, the Makarov is a little bit harder to do, and there is a knack to it, I'm still learning it. So, it's exactly the same, you put the spring in like so, bring the slide back, put the slide on like so, which went remarkably well, put the trigger guard in like that, and then even with this one, you can even work, use its working decocking lever, apply the safety, and the gun is now safe. And then obviously you can put your magazines back in their respective guns. And you're ready to store them or to use them or to do whatever you want with them. Now if you have any questions about either of these guns, uh, it doesn't have to necessarily be about both of them. But if you have any questions either on the Makarov here or the PPK about maintenance, um, oils to use, stuff like that or anything else you can think of, feel free to, uh, to comment or send us an email. We also have full tabletop reviews of both of these guns out now so that so if you want to learn more about the specifications of each gun or maybe its features etc. We also have the firing review of the PPK being filmed today. I think, I think we've just finished that one sorry. So that will be edited up later on and we're also later on in the day today filming the Makarov review here. So we'll have full firing reviews of both coming up soon. We are a little bit behind on videos, but we're trying to catch up. Um, if you watch the PPK firing review, we also have a little bit of a surprise at the, at the end. If you haven't checked out our website, it's, uh, it's going to be up there already. So uh, thank you for watching another Replica Reviews video. As I've said before, and I'll say it again, any questions, feel free to uh, rate, comment and subscribe. Thank you very much.